My name's Donnie Merrill. Welcome. We're uh, in the kitchen of Skipjack uh, Donnie right here in Newark, Delaware. I am uh, the chef and owner. Um, today I will be making you a pan seared black sea bass um, with some delicata squash, some uh, quart soaked cranberries, roasted apples, balsamic mushrooms. We're going to finish it with a little fresh arugula and basil. A uh, little shot of marsala. We have a little olive oil. We have our black sea bass here that we've marked briefly. Keeping it healthy, we're just gonna do a light dusting of sea salt and just a pinch of black pepper. Make sure our pan gets plenty hot. This is a delicata squash right here. It'll be available for the next couple months. Beautiful, sweet flavored squash. What I've done is I've taken this, I sliced it into rings little salt and pepper, little olive oil, and a little Parmesan cheese. So our pan now is nice and hot. Get into it so it's really nice when you crisp it up. We'll pull this out briefly. We'll throw it in the oven just for a minute. A little garlic in our pan, a little bit of mushroom. We'll deglaze briefly with a little bit of Marsala wine. Add some roasted apples, some pork soaked cranberries, some fresh basil. I'm gonna use a little bit of walnut oil, a hint of white balsamic, apple juice, squeeze of lemon, We'll let that saute for a minute. Okay, so to plate our uh, sea bass, we'll take our Parmesan roasted delicata squash first. Go ahead and put your rings right on the plate. We'll get our little mixture here of our apples and everything. I'm gonna put a little bit on, a little bit down first. Then get our nice crispy bass put on top. And we'll finish with just a little bit more of the salad on top. And we're all done. You have crispy seared black sea bass over Parmesan roasted delicata squash with roasted apple, port cranberries, mushrooms, and a nice little apple and uh, balsamic. Thank you very much.